Good morning. Today we are going to see about network software. Network software encompasses a broad range of software used for design, implementation and operate the monitor of computer network. Traditional networks were hardware based with software embedded. With the advent of software defined networking, software is separated from the hardware thus making it more adaptable to the ever changing nature of the computer network. Networking software is a foundational element of any network. It helps administrator deploy, manage and monitor a network. Traditional networks are made up of specialized hardware such as routers and switches that bundles the network software into the solution. Software defined network separates the software from the hardware making it easier to innovate and adopt the network to quick meet change changing network demands. The separation of functions from hardware such as firewall or loading um, balancing is called network functioning uh, virtualization. The next one is function functions of network software. It helps to set up and install computer networks, enable users to have, have access to network resources in a seamless manner, allows administrator to add or remove user from the network, helps to define locations of data storage and allow users to access the data, helps administrator and secure system to protect the network from the data benches, unauthorized access and attacks on the network, enables a network virtualization. The next one is SDN framework. SDN framework contains of three layers. The first layer is application layer. Application layer is the SDN application resides in the application layer. The applications convey their needs from the resource and the service to the control layer through the application. The next layer is control layer. The network control software bundles into the network operating system lies in this layer. It provides the abstract view of the underlying network infrastructure. It receives the requirement of the SDN application and relays them to the network component. The last layer is the infrastructure layer. It is also called as the data plan layer. This layer contains the actual network component. The network device resides in the layer that shows their network capability through the control to the data plan um, infrastructure. The next one is the features of the um, software. The network software is not the same as software application. The former exposes the inner working of the networking network or to administration. While software application enables end user to perform specific tasks, network software is invisible to the end users. It is simply used to facilitate the access through the user having the network resources in a seamless way. The basic functions in uh, including both user management and file management. User management enables administrator to add or remove user from the network. File management allows administrator to define the location of data storage and user access to the data. Network software allows multiple devices such as desktop, laptop, mobile phones, tables and other synthesis to connect to one another as well as another network. Thank you for watching.